Most of us have been in church at some point in our lives. Many of us have had some type of a relationship with God as well. But it's so easy to get disconnected. Life gets rough, gets hard, circumstances come up, temptation comes up and we fall off. On top of all that, maybe you went to church and you just thought the music, the preaching, the dress code, or just the environment, it really wasn't relevant to you. Maybe even some shady stuff happened at a church you went to, or someone you knew that claimed that they were a Christian did you wrong. All those things can kind of fuel the disconnection that we have from God, but yet most of us will still say we believe in Him and we're uncomfortable with being disconnected from Him because we know we're not really living right and we know that something is missing. But how do we fix that? How do we make it right? What does having a relationship with God really look like and really feel like? Well, if you've had those questions, I'm glad you're listening to this. I had those questions too. I wondered how I could authentically live for God and still be me. As you can see from this CD, I'm, I'm still being me. But using my gifts and talents for the Creator, I've come back home. So what does it take for you to come back home? Simply to realize and admit where you are. You're disconnected with God and you want to make it right. You want to get forgiven and follow His purpose for your life. Without that, you'll always feel lost. You'll never experience true peace. You know what, it's no accident that you're checking this out. God is using this recording to once again call you back home to His family, His plan, His peace, His love. That's real talk. Home isn't just a spiritual place with your Creator. It's also a physical place where you can be in community with others that share the same faith. We can't do it alone. God wired us that we need each other. It's one of the main reasons that the church exists. The definition of the church is it's a group of people together on a mission. It's not just a place, but it's a place where people come together. They worship together. They build, get to know each other. They listen to teaching together. They just have some great fellowship. It's an important element to stay on track. You know what, the church, it's not perfect because people are involved. People can be messy. But at Crossover, we strive to be a church that strips down all the man-made tradition as we focus on the essentials of the Bible in an atmosphere that's real and relevant where you can be you and you can feel at home. Our sole purpose is to bring your sole purpose. So if you came through and you were feeling it, we want to let you know we're here for you. We hope to get to know you better, hope that you can continue to grow in your spiritual journey, and know that there's a spot for you right here in our family. So if you're still trying to find your way back home, all you have to do is just talk to God, say yes to Jesus Christ, ask for that forgiveness, ask to be reconnected, and build with Him. You can't earn it, you can't make it up, you can't get yourself ready enough. I hear many people say that sometimes, but you know what? Just come back home, just as you are. Your father's calling you, and he's waiting with open arms.